Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. Alright guys, good evening, sorry for the wind, welcome back, Ooh. half past seven, one, niner, uh, couldn't leave well enough alone, so I decided to break a headlight, dun dun dun, dun dun dun, 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 dun. Meow. Meow. Anyway, took the grill off and started putting it on and had the grill standing up on one side or the other, I don't remember. And uh, it decided to break. The wind knocked it over, broke a headlight. So, gotta get a new headlight anyway. Anywho, you take a look at that. The Maester piece. The Mr. Piece. The Mr. Piece of junk. Um, so I'm just going to hook up the headlights real quick. Put this wiring in the front radiator support thingy, my jigger. I think, maybe not. Oh, almost had it. Oh well. So what I'm gonna do is just go ahead and plug some wires in. Cause I'm gonna plug the truck in. Oh man. And see what headlights burnt out. I'm not gonna fire it up guys. I ain't doesn't that. Mean. What? The broke did headlight is the one that works. Oh, oh no, I was unsafe. Need highs and lows, but I don't. This one was uh, dim, so let's see if the high beams work on them. Let me know. Probably just need to get two new headlights. Two new headlights, because, like I said, I think that one was going bad to begin with unless I somehow cut the wires with ouch whatever got lights got lights Ooh. so that's why I decided to stop because the uh, wind is coming Good. <laughs> Looks scary. Um. Oh. Duh. Need the key on for the splinkers to work. Then that'll get rid of that noise. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, that light's about to burn up. Come back here. Got the blinkers back there. Oh. Shut her all off. So, as you can see, so I think that's four low. Neutral, too high, four low. So, 
So yeah, I had to adjust that. So far, so good. So what I'm gonna do is I gotta clean up this mess. This metal is from cutting this down here to clear that oil cooler. And uh, yeah, man, sorry guys. I wish, wish I would've got the, the white pipe. But I did not. So kind of sucks in a way because I could uh, potentially be driving this right now. What's wrong with that hood? I think I need to go forward. So there we have it. So the rear is all the way low. Someone's hitting red limiter. Anyway guys, it is 6 to 50. I'm going to go take me a share. Um, I'm going to clean up that glass first. Take me a shower. And then of course, I didn't have a mess. No, I got a mess. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll go from there. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I like it. I like it so much. Put it up for sale. Yeah. I don't. I don't know if you guys have seen, but I'm looking at trucks on OfferUp and Craigslist that are. Uh, I think there was a '91 extra cab two-wheel drive, at least out here. It was, it was pretty clean, but I think it had like 213,000 miles on it, and the guy wanted eighty-four hundred dollars for it. And I'm just like, what? For an OBS Chevy? Extra cab? It wasn't, and it wasn't short bed, it was long bed. And then, uh, I've been seeing these trucks, like, in project form. Two-wheel drive. You know, regular frame, regular everything. Going for 6500 bucks For, like, a 63, 64. Just Chevy truck that's been sitting in the desert. Looks like this. Kind of beat up more. Some are beat up less. 6500 bucks. So, can't wait to get this thing going. Sell this, sell this beast for 10 grand. 10 grand. Anyway, I don't know yet. We'll have to figure that all that out. Um, but anyway, make sure you guys guess. Guess on what I'm purchasing for the Mega Cab. Some people probably won't get it. Some people, one person might. Only because I told the one person. But uh, anyway, 1800 bucks is what I spent for the part. And uh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to pay for itself in the long run. I could just say that. But anyway, guys, that's it. I'm done. I'm uh, I'm hungry. I'm dirty. See you guys on the next video. Tell me what you guys think of Project Crack Pipe. All right, guys. See you on the next video. Peace.